Hi guys. Hope everyone's doing well. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Jocelyn. If you haven't been here before, I would love for you to subscribe. I do a little bit of mostly beauty, but we do some lifestyle, um, clothing hauls. I have a lot of stuff coming. I've been MIA for a little bit. Um, for those of you that don't know, I battle with chronic pancreatitis. So um, when I have a flare up, it, it just kind of puts me in the bed and I can't do much. So hopefully now we have it under control for a little while and I can get back to filming regularly. As you can see, I'm so sorry about the lighting. It Today it's decided that, hey, Arkansas is going to get a, you know, tornado watch and we're gonna rain and storm. And I really needed to get the, this video up because Merit Beauty was kind enough to send me a little PR package with their new signature lip lightweight lipsticks. Lightweight, I can't talk, lipsticks. And these just released how pretty the packaging is oh my gosh and they are let's run down a little bit about these they are lightweight buildable satin finish clean cruelty free vegan these are going to be available in eight shades um they were kind enough to give me two shades and i chose let's see i chose fashion which is a mauve I'll insert some uh, clips here. A bit in natural light too, but this one is just like a mauve berry color, which is so pretty. It matches so much stuff for spring and it can also take you into fall. So I love that color. And then I also got the shade Millennial. I cannot get over the packaging. Oh, it's just so, so pretty. Okay, a millennial is more of a nude rosy pink color. And we are going to try these on today so you guys can see what they look like. And like I said, I think I said, they are available in eight shades. They're available in Tiger, Cabo, 1990, Lavenu, I think I'm saying that right, Fashion, Millennial, Baby, and Slip. And I think uh, Friday when Sephora does their sale, I'm going to be picking up Slip and Tiger as well to go with these because I tried these. These are so comfortable on the lips. I have really dry lips, dry skin. Um, I am, am just turned 45, so of course... I'm dry, I have fine lines, wrinkles, and my lips are starting to show age too. I've got a sore right there. I found that these had a very long stain power. I ate with them and everything. Of course, they are a satin formula, so they're not gonna be like a matte formula that's super long wear. You will have to reapply, but for a satin formula, they, they stayed really well. When they did wear off, it was um, very, like even I didn't have patches everywhere so I'm really impressed with these um and definitely will be picking some more up Merit also was kind enough to gift me a few more products um they I chose the Beverly Hills cheek color the shade Beverly Hills it's a cream as you can see I've already had my fingers in it <laughs> I love it I actually do own another shade of this I don't have it a here at my desk, but I did purchase that one on my own. Um, so yeah, enough talking. Let's play with some of this. I already have my, um, of course my foundation and, and brows and everything done, but let's go ahead and get started. Okay. As I did mention, these were gifted to me and, um, but the thoughts are completely my thoughts. I will never tell you if I don't like something that I do. That's just not going to happen. I can't promote something I don't like. But I do really, really enjoy these lipsticks. And I really love this Beverly Hills. Uh, it's called the Flush Balm. Just so I can make sure I'm telling you right. And it's a cream cheek color. So we are going to go ahead and apply some of this. 
and I usually just take it and I put it on the back of my hand and it, it is a very light cream balm formula and then I just dip in with my sponge and then dab on if I can keep my hair out of it and the good thing I like about this is while it is a cream formula it does not get my hair stuck in it and for me that is that's a have to like I, I cannot stand formulas that my hair gets all stuck in because I usually have pieces even in the summer that's down like I have right now around my face but look, I mean, it just, you can build it up or you can just leave a light wash. I kind of like a no makeup look on most days with just a really light wash of color. But this can be built up to where you have quite a bit of pigment in it. But this formula is just so comfortable and easy to use. Ugh, I could get heavy handed with this. I love it so much. Good thing about this is, though, you literally, you can't overdo it. So good. I always feel like the lights wash me out really bad. So, I overapply sometimes. But in this case, you really can't. And if you do think you have applied too much, just take the end of your sponge that you put your foundation on or your brush or whatever and just kind of tap around it and just so you know i this is going on over powder i forgot and ac accidentally powdered my face normally i'll do my cream products first um, but as you can see like that it went on so pretty even over the powder it didn't lift any of my foundation or cake up or anything so I that's such a bomb product so good and I probably will definitely be picking up some more shades in that too again that shade on that one is Beverly Hills so okay um something else they had sent me which I did already use if I can find it I gotta get back in the rhythm of filming it's been so long that I'm just totally out of practice Okay, maybe I already put it up. I did. Okay, so they also sent me their brow, let me make sure I'm saying it right, their brow 1980, and it's a volumizing pomade. Their packaging is so sleek and pretty. So I really do like that. It's really easy. Again, just kind of a no makeup, brush it through the brows and go. I probably would maybe choose one shade lighter just because I feel like the shade I got, I don't even remember which one I got, is a tad too dark for me. I got brown, so I probably should have went one up. And next time I get some, I probably will. But I do really, really like that as well. Um, I was also sent this tinted lip oil. I love tinted lip oil, especially for the summer. And I got shade, I think it's pronounced Cara Cara or Cara Cara. I'm not sure, but that is the shade. It's like a really nice rust color. Again, this will be great. Just a light lip oil for spring. It's kind of, it's got a little bit of pigment, but it's mostly sheer. Just a little wash of color. But this, again, would be really great in the fall, too. So, that's what that looks like. And they sent me their... I have not tried this before. This is their Clean Lash Lengthening Tubing Mascara. So, I'm very excited. I got Perfect Black in this. Very excited to try this because I have not tried their any of their mascara and stuff before. They are a relatively new brand. They started about three years ago. And uh, so they're available at MeritBeauty.com, Sephora, Sephora Canada online, and of course in store at Sephora. Um, I'm pretty sure that all of their products are all clean and uh, paraben free, sulfate free, all that. So 
great for the skin. Okay, let me go apply this mascara and I'll come right back and we will try on those lipsticks. Okay, wow, we got our lashes on. It is a, I think I did mention it is a tubing mascara, but I'm very happy with how that turned out. They're really pretty. I um, love these small wands like this because I have hooded eyes and small eyes. And so it's one of the very skinny natural brush wands. Really like that. And I only put just uh, about two coats on. They really gave me a lot of length. Great lengthening mascara, yes. I love that. Okay. On to the good part, the lipsticks. Okay, we are going to start out with... First, let me wipe the makeup off my lips. What's weather like where you live? We haven't getting nothing but rain. I was uh, in Nebraska for my doctor's appointment for my pancreas. And when we was up there the whole time it snowed and then we get back home and it's raining. We had like maybe two sunny days. So I'm ready for some good sunshine. And if you see my mess in the back, I'm sorry. I haven't gotten everything unpacked yet. So anyway, okay, on with why we're here. The signature lip lightweight lipsticks. I think I got that right, yeah. All right, so we're gonna start with Millennial. This is the darker um, mauve berry shade. shade. I believe or is that no sorry that is the nude pink rosy shade let's I think I want to end with that one because I think that's the one I'm gonna to wear today so let's start with millennial this one is the berry shade and they have merit if I can get it turned right in there you can see where I've already been using them okay and I'm, I don't think I'm going to use a lip liner. We're just going to go in. They just glide on so smooth. Sorry, if you see me looking over here, I am uh, using my mirror over here. I like to pat that out after I apply. Now, if you see a dry patch here, that is not the lipstick. That is me. I have been so dry with the different uh, allergies and stuff starting to bloom here in Arkansas. So, anyway, yeah, that's not it. That's me. <laughs> so, this is the shade Millennial. So pretty. And of course you could uh, do a lip liner under here and really go around the edges. Um, I may do that with the other one that I plan to wear all day, but this one can be of course layered up even more. Such a pretty shade. This one is going to be so pretty for spring. That's what that looks like. Sorry, I'm using my viewfinder as a mirror. You don't get professional here. <laughs> All right, so let me get a fresh wet wipe. And take this off so we can do our other shade. Okay, now that we got those all wiped off, Hopefully I didn't take too much of my foundation with that. We're gonna go in and line with my Charlotte Tilbury lip pencil in Bel Air.
and we are going to go in with fashion and this will be the one I wear all day today rosy nude color these are so creamy <laughs> These really, really feel so good on the lips. They're so hydrating. All right, go ahead and pop that. And that is the shade Fashion. I think that one is like my good every day. This is generally the color I'm wearing, so. Mm, I love these. I do have an affiliate link for these that I will uh, link down below. I do make a small percentage if you choose to shop through this link and uh, you definitely do not have to, but I really appreciate it if you do. It just helps my channel, helps me put put back into my channel so I can do more reviews for you. So um, I really appreciate it if you choose to shop on my link. And, but even if you don't, don't go check these out. They are so good. And if you can get them on the Sephora sale, even better. Like I'm definitely going to go pick up some more shades in these. <clears throat> Great hydrating lipsticks. Like they really, there's something special in these. They're so, so creamy and they really are long lasting for a satin lipstick. So I'm really really happy with these and thank you so much to Merit for sending them over I really appreciate it and yeah I hope you guys have a great week and hopefully I can get back on track and get some more reviews out to you and hope to see you guys soon I'll talk to you later bye